So today I'll be setting theory aside and I'll be sharing with you some more personal stories. Uh, how the 7am specifically helped me get out of a rut uh, a while ago and also a few testimonials from other people to show you that this isn't a program that works for just one type of people. Before we do that though, let's very quickly recap what we talked about in the previous videos, which if you haven't watched so far, make sure that you do so right now. So in the previous four videos, we covered a lot of groundwork. I showed you how to quickly get started with a 7 a.m. workout edge. We talked about the biggest mistake that people make when it comes to morning exercise. And I even walked you through my entire blueprint. So if you haven't watched those four videos so far, make sure that you do so right now because they have a lot of important information and they will be a game changer for your morning workout routine. So starting with my story, a few years ago, I decided to start a local personal coaching business. And just as with my online project, I would help people get in shape through calisthenics. The funny thing is that although a year later, my business was doing great, I had more clients that I could train, my actual own personal fitness was going downhill. Now, since I was the only coach in the company at first, I ended up working cold day, having a chaotic and exhausting schedule and slowly maintaining a standard workout time for myself uh, seemed impossible. So what I did is I, I just waited for an opportunity to work out during the time that least interfered with my clientele's preferences. Of course, this ended up being a terrible idea and figuring out every day, you know, when will I find uh, some time to exercise just became one more thing in my to-do list that I stressed about. So I typically kept postponing my workouts throughout the day. If a client would cancel at the last moment's notice in the late afternoon, I could squeeze a workout during their session or otherwise, you know, I would have to train in the late evening once I was done with work. Although I was in the mood to train in the morning, the more the day progressed, the more my appetite for exercise would diminish. I had less energy and patience and my workouts felt more and more forced and less and less enjoyable. What I realized was that I didn't just need a rigid and consistent workout time. What I really needed was a workout time that would be completely impervious to any kind of responsibility I had, either that was professional or personal. A workout time that I wouldn't mind shutting off my phone. I wouldn't have other people get in my way. Look, I'm not antisocial, but uh, I do need my alone time for at least an hour a day. I don't know about you. And that's when I discovered morning exercise. My morning workout routine became an almost spiritual practice for me. The early peace and solitude combined with the physical exertion, uh, they gave me the mental space I needed to get aligned with what was important for me. After each workout, I felt physically and mentally lighter and I could start my day with a sense of accomplishment and self-confidence. All that combined with the mood boosting chemicals in my bloodstream gave me the momentum I needed to stay productive during the rest of the day. At first, I was afraid that my morning workouts might interfere with my energy levels during work. I'm a coach, you know, I have to be energetic at work, but I was actually feeling better. I was drinking less coffee. I stopped drinking energy drinks and I actually had more energy. Even my clients noticed something different about me. And as somebody told me, I looked more relaxed and energetic at the same time. So that was how the 7 a.m. workout edge helped me get out of a rut a while ago. And I could keep on talking about all the benefits that the 7 a.m. workout edge had on me and keeps on having on me. But right now, I would also like to share with you two testimonials so you can hear other people's opinions as well. So testimonial number one is from an old good friend of mine that I haven't seen in years who happened to call me when I was finishing this program and asked me for some guidance regarding him getting back on track with his fitness goals. I find that people who are closer to you can be more honest and oftentimes even your harshest critics. So I asked from Akis to be as honest, as impartial and as unbiased as possible for this testimonial. So let's see what he has to say. Hey guys, my name is Zaki and I'd like to share with you my experience with the 7 a.m. workout club. Like a lot of people, I like working out, but I have a problem with consistency. <laughs> Uh, for years, I thought that working out in the afternoon is better, uh, better in terms of building muscle, and burning fat. I tried to build a habit of working out around 6 p.m., but life has a funny manner of getting in the way. Uh, something would pop up almost every day that would force me to delay my workout or cancel it altogether. Um, skipping my workout felt like a failure. 
I wasn't building muscle or burning fat. And my sleep also started to suffer. Uh, pretty quickly I was eating junk food and lots of it. Uh, and I wasn't keen on uh, maintaining a healthy relationship uh, with myself and my body. So if I couldn't work out uh, at the optimal time, I shouldn't work out at all, obviously. Uh, which led to me gaining weight and not looking as well, as fit as I used to. Uh, until I reached out to Anthony and he told me about the 7 a.m. workout club. I was skeptical at first because, you know, this voice in my head uh, telling me is working out in the morning as good as it is in the afternoon. Uh, will I be strong enough in the morning? Can I really build muscle like this? Um, am I in the mood to do that? Do I feel like getting out of bed 6.30 in the morning and start, you know, uh, with a cup of coffee and uh, getting ready to work out. So Anthony really took time to address my concerns and uh, he helped me understand that if the body starts moving, the brain will follow. It's just a matter of uh, getting dressed and doing that first rep, uh, completing that first set and then moving on to the next exercise. Um, exercise in the morning beats not exercising in the evening. So it doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be a perfect workout, you just have to get it done. Um, Anthony also helped me be more mindful of my inner critic and helped me realize that I was getting in my own way, in a sense, uh, by coming up with all these excuses and all these thoughts on why I shouldn't uh, work out uh, instead of focusing on why I should. And also, I realized that if you can't make uh, an agreement with yourself that, you know, I will dedicate 35, 45 minutes uh, on working out, how can you uh, hold your end of uh, a bargain when you're making agreements with other people? Uh, so I've been doing this program now since January, and so far I'm enjoying all the benefits that come with exercising. Uh, my mood has improved, uh, my sleep is way better, I feel rested when I wake up in the morning, and I also feel stronger and fitter. So I welcome you all to try Anthony's uh, program, the 7 a.m. Workout Club, and to be open to his guidance. Uh, with his program, you will not only learn how to exercise better, but also how to build a healthy habit and hold yourself accountable. Uh, I hope you try it and I'm sure you'll be as satisfied as I am. Good luck and all the best. The second person's testimonial I want to share with you comes from my significant other. Now, uh, I've always found it the most difficult to train the people that I had this kind of relationship with in the past. So I thought of what other better way to put the 7 a.m. workout edge to the test. Plus, she also happens to be a doctor, which means that she has 24-hour work shifts, she uh, is often on call, and having such a demanding job, I wanted to see how the 7 a.m. workout edge would work in her case. Hey guys, I'm Stavrula, and the 7 a.m. workout edge has helped me, first of all, to be consistent with my workouts. I started it after a few unsuccessful attempts to get back to the training routine I had some months ago. I kept finding excuses like I'm too tired or I have more important things to do like my work or my master's degree. So all these things really left me no choice but to keep postponing my afternoon workouts. To be honest, uh, I was a bit skeptical at first. I was wondering if this would be an enthusiastic three days trial and then to point zero again. But as soon as I built my morning routine, everything changed. I guess dedicating this um, daytime before work to my training and keeping my training short but effective really puts me in the mood not to want to miss a workout while it gives me this um, physical and psychological boost I need. I must say that I am more energetic after my morning workout, something that my colleagues surprisingly also notice, even if I have a 24-hour shift ahead of me like today. Um, the hardest part for me though, and I'm not really proud to admit that, uh, was to stay away from this 
daily obsessive uh, scrolling at my social media as soon as I open my eyes. But now I can say that I peacefully enjoy my morning coffee and by dawn I can cross out from my daily tasks the thing that uh, helps me perform better throughout the day, my 7am workout. So those were a few testimonials from other people and how the 7am workout has helped them. People who followed the same exact steps that I'll be sharing in a few days in my upcoming masterclass, the 7am workout club. I'm really, really excited about this course. I've put a lot of hard work into creating it and I can't wait until more people hop on the 7am workout edge and I really want to see the positive impact it will have on other people's lives. As much as I'd like to help everyone, you know, I can only accept a small number of students right now in order to provide the appropriate support and help you get the results you want. Therefore, keep in mind that this is genuinely a rare opportunity and spots will be granted on a first come first served basis. I honestly consider this the best program I've created and after seeing the response so far, I wouldn't be amazed if the course sold out in a few hours. So the moment the registration opens, make sure that you hop on board. You don't want to miss the next video because that's where I'll give you specific instructions on how you can make sure to reserve your spot. And I'll also share with you some more information about the course and how the 7am workout club is so different from other things that you might have seen so far. So that was all. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. And I'll next time, keep on training.